Hey, it's Lee Hayward here from LeeHayward.com, and I'm going to show you how to make one of my favorite meals, which is a chicken breast and egg white omelet. And I'm just going to go over what you need for this right here. Let's zoom in the camera right here. So what I have actually is a couple chicken breasts that were left over from yesterday. Uh, I have a carton of egg whites, 500 mils, which is two cups. Uh, some onion, a couple mushrooms, salsa, uh, Mrs. Dash for spices, a couple fat-free cheese slices. What I'm going to do is first preheat the pan, uh, put it on medium heat, and I'm going to spray in a bit of pan spray. chicken breasts here and I'm just going to chop them up and put them in the pan. This is a really tasty high protein and low carb meal. So I mean you could have this anytime if you're you know dieting a low carb diet you could have it or you could combine it with the uh, you know, with some other foods, like if you want to have, uh, say, potatoes or yams or rice or something like that, and you could have, a, you know, an off-season meal and have this as your protein for that meal. Okay, so I just... Put the chicken breast in, and I'm going to chop up some onion. Mushrooms, so mushrooms, onions, chicken breasts. some egg whites. Like I say, this is two cups of liquid egg whites, which is approximately the same as 16 egg whites if you separated them manually. Okay, that. Now I'm just going to stir this up. some Mrs. Dash. Now you can add whatever spices or seasonings that you like. I just happen to like this one. It's a, a Mrs. Dash seasoning blend. So. Alright, so what I'm going to do now is just cover this and leave it for a few minutes until the egg whites start to harden. Just cover and just leave it. It should only take a few minutes. All right, now I'm just going to check the egg whites, and, you know, and as you can see, the egg whites now are, are solidified and they're hardened up, and everything's cooking along nicely. So what I'm going to do is add in some fat-free cheese slices. Just lay the lay them right on the top. I have three slices here. salsa. Uh, this happens to be mild salsa. I'm not too keen on really spicy food. Just mix it a bit there. Spread that around a bit. Okay. 
Now I'm going to cover this again for another couple minutes to let the cheese melt. Like I say, it should only take about 60 seconds or so at max, and the cheese should be melted, and then we'll be able to stir it up again. All right. There we go. Now this is the cheese is melted, and it's all it's pretty much cooked here now. So what I'm going to do is just take a spatula and go around the edge of the pan here to make sure it's freed up. You know, where I sprayed the pan good with the pan spray, it shouldn't stick too much. There we go. Actually, this needs another couple minutes because it's still a little bit soft on the top. But what I'm going to do is when this is all fully hard and cooked, I can fold it in half and then, you know, serve it up on a plate. There's actually enough here for a couple of very generous servings of this uh, egg white chicken breast omelet. So I'm going to leave this actually uncovered, just on low heat, for another minute or so, just until, you know, some of the liquid that absorbs off it, and then uh, I'll be able to serve it up on the plates. Alright, well, well there we go. I just uh, took it up and divided the omelette between two servings. Uh, each serving has about 60 grams of protein, uh, less than 10 grams of carbs, and only about 5 grams of fat. So this is an excellent meal that you can have any time. It tastes delicious and it only took about 10 minutes to prepare. So uh, give it a try and uh, leave me some feedback and let me know how you, how you like it. Talk to you again soon.